Hello again, YouTube. Today I've decided to experiment with masks. So the idea I came up with was that I'm going to make myself an eclipse. So one side's going to be a moon and the other the sun. So we're just going to experiment with some different Mayron makeups and see what we come up with and hopefully you enjoy. First I'm going to just pull back my hair to keep it on my face when I'm experimenting. Now, we're going to be using Mayron Metallic Powder. Looks like this. We're going to use both silver and gold and perhaps some bronze or copper as well. It comes with this mixing liquid and you mix it together and just helps it set really nicely. So, I'm going to mix up some gold first to start with the sun. And you can mix as much as you need. If you don't think it's uh, thick enough, add more powder. Too thick, add more liquid. Looking good in gold. <laughs> so. So I don't know how well it shows up on the video, but this is like real metallic gold. It is flawless. <laughs> now to mix up the silver. Looking cool already. Before I go any further with the makeup, I'm going to put in some contacts for a dramatic effect using a different color for each eye. Ooh. Gold for the sun. And of course, silver for the moon. Touch up paint as needed. And now we can proceed. Switching to a smaller brush to add definition to the sun, adding some rays. And after I have the rays, I'm going to add copper to that. Now to mix up a little copper. Now I'm going to give a border to both the sun and the moon and also dress up my eyeliner a bit. For 
the sun side. I had a little bit extra for an Egyptian type look, almost modeled after the sun god. For the moon, just kind of plain for now. May do something more with it later. Now, on the moon side, I'm going to dress it up a bit by adding diamond powder. This stuff is awesome. Also by Miron, like everything else I use. <laughs> I'm use just a big brush and kind of dot it on. Bring it down a bit so it's kind of like moonlight shining down. And add a few sequins as stars. Because for some reason I feel like the moon is definitely a very feminine figure, I'm going to add some lashes to this side. A little mascara. And just for effect, I'm going to add some earrings, gold for the sun side, and silver, of course, for the moon. <laughs> and here you have it, a very thrown together but somewhat fun moon and sun mask. A close up for you. Hopefully you enjoyed, and maybe you'll get to use this look at a uh, upcoming mask party. If you have any questions, let me know. I definitely would love to recommend any product you're interested in. And thanks!